Today we're going to make these super cute crocheted earrings. My favorite adjective, super cute. Um, all you need is two colors of yarn. I'm using cotton and for this example I'm going to use yellow and white and this yarn calls for a three to a three and a half millimeter crochet hook. I crochet tight so I'm using a 3.75. You're going to start off with a slip knot and a chain of 14. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14. Then we're going to slip stitch to the beginning. Chain three. And then we're going to fit as many double crochets into this ring as we possibly can. We want it to be nice and tight. So, So for me, it was 36. So we're going to slip stitch. One more to tie it off. Cut our string. And we're done with the first color. And we're going to get our second color. I'm going to use white. And once again, slip knot. Chain 14, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. And we're gonna bring it in here like this and do our slip knot. And this loop took 36, so we're going to try and squeeze 36 into this. Double crochets. Just have to work around this loop here.
slip stitch. want to weave in our ends tail here. This one, I did it the smart way and worked over top of that tail. Okay. Now what I like to do is you got a pretty side, you were and a bad side, the bet front and back. Those are the front. I like to take my where I had to slip stitch and work them in behind each other. Okay, so get this threaded. We're going to weave in our ends. And I'm going to come through the yellow one. It's going to help hold it in place so that those ends stay hidden behind each other. All you have to do is add a jump ring and an earring wire and you get the cutest little retro interlocking circle earrings done in like 10 minutes. So you just make a pair. Put the hooks on and you're good to go. So happy crocheting and thank you for watching.